Hi there and happy Mother's Day. So we learned in the previous two videos how to find the surface area of this cuboid and how to find the volume of this cuboid. The third scale that you need uh, to learn today when you deal with prisms or 3D objects um, is drawing or sketching a net. Okay, to start the drawing, always I want you to start with the face that is on the floor. The face that is sitting on the floor, which is this one here. So, it is a rectangle. Let's imagine that this is how it looks like. The most important thing when you draw this, write the dimensions. So this is the seven, this is the three. Every two opposite sides in a rectangle are equal. So this is seven, this is opposite, opposite to this side, so it is three as well. Then I want you to imagine that the left side here is actually falling on the floor like this. So from here to here, it's going to be nine. And from here to here, when it falls on the floor, it's going to be three. Let's draw this rectangle here. So this is nine, this is nine, this is three as well, three and three. And then, I want you to imagine that this front face is falling on the floor as well, like this. So this length here from here to here is the nine, right? So so this is seven, this is seven, this is nine, this is nine. So when these two sides stand up, they're going to meet together. So it makes sense, right? Perfect. So one, two, three faces. If this is the left side, so this is here opposite to it is the right side. So you draw an, an identical piece to this one. So, and you take the exact same measurements of this face and here if this one stands up opposite to it is going to be the back face so you're going to draw an identical piece to this one so it's something like this so uh, and you take the exact same measurements take nine nine and this is seven Okay, so one, two, three, four, five faces. The third, uh, sorry, the sixth face, because a cuboid has six faces, it's going to be the top. So front, back, floor, right and left side. The top, this is the top, is the exact same as the floor. So you're going to put it from this side. with the exact same dimensions, seven, seven. If this is three, this is three. So this is our net. So let's summarize it. Perfect. So this is the floor. This is the top. This is the left side. And this is the right side. This is the front. And this is the back. Now, can you find the surface area using the net? Consider the net as a 2D object and find the area of each 
shape in it of each rectangle in it and then add them. So you're going to say surface area is equal to what is the size of this one? It's three times seven. And I have two pieces of it. So two plus what is the size of this piece? It's three times nine. And I have two pieces of it. So it's times two plus what is the area of this piece? It's seven times nine. And I have two pieces of it. And if you carry on with the calculation, you're going to end up with the exact same surface area that we found, which is 22 centimeter squared. I hope this is clear and thank you so much for watching.